Hello, another expert in the days of a star, it is a good thing as a dream. Do you want to hear my dream? Oh no. Oh, this skeleton here is Arthur. <coughs> I was meditating on a figurine of Megamar. I dreamed he would put his followers' classmates in Megamind group. Yes, I thought he was human and alive going to India and stuff and doing those Megamind blue nance and things. Great vitamin. And I met him on the blue alien. Which, if you go to Miller Mega Cast Blog's concert, you'll see a list of alien autopsies, alien footage, and a guy possessed by a blue alien. An exorcism, an alien thing that is alien exorcism, right? Not one of the And he was, you have to be, when you go in his lair, he'd possess them and they would uh, they get out of their cages or become themselves in Omega Mind. They could not get out of his lair. They try to get out of his lair, they were locked in. And they go in the light machine and just play his video games or his waffle makers, any, he did anything with anything in his lair. They would have to go strong with them amount of time, a very long time, or do it more than they could handle, especially hot sauce and food. And uh, they couldn't escape, and they all turned them back in their cages, or, and then the rest of the students that uh, would get possessed by him, and they would have to go into his shop. Let's say he had a light machine, he had to be a long time, let's say he had a sperm donation tag or to jerk off to Mega Mind. Or you had a little machine that turned you into him or whatever. I just saw that they were stuck in his lair and they couldn't get out. And I saw, and I saw that he had a video game station and some items registered in my name. It's a video game. A video game. You had to trick people out of their food and then get bonus rewards by God eating their food and then the villains have the villain god, so they go back to this villain or they go back to heaven because humans are uh, cursed or evil. They get rewarded for fucking with the humans. So uh, I thought that was weird. I had a dream of Megamind's Leia and I touched his statue. But I did not sleep with it that day. In fact, I was cuddling with a sonic doll that day. And I had a dream about being a paranormal investigator, having a child who like mismatched clothes, and uh, going into some kind of canyon search of these trails to find the devil, doing this wavering wave, some kind of investigator with a guitar, and then wavering playing this and laying down in front of the frequencies you know, to see if the devil or the cloaked beings are there just to pick up um, some kind of data from the cloaked beings because I have these scanners and I was like I want to be a private investigator and maybe I'll even use my own money and do at least five haunted places and if they like it I can get funded for it um, I was watching the news today, I was like, you know what, I bet you burn on fire if you're in his trunk. I thought telepathically he sent that image to my mind. And then later on he committed suicide burning himself in on fire. And some kids or someone had confessed that he was, they went camping and put her in a trunk of car. And I, I thought I heard him like, and he was in his mind like he didn't know what to do. Because I'm a psychic and I was a student psychic, a stir psychic students. And... <coughs> this one guy keeps harassing me just for events and he said that you know about them you didn't donate to me so unless you donate to me stop harassing me it's clearly in bold the subscription is gmail my hotmail account is a donation it wouldn't have gone through if you donated to the wrong email it's a starly sigo singer at hotmail.com is my donation email stop harassing me <coughs> I'm getting an ultrasound soon on New Year's Eve, so 
maybe things will look helpful. So no matter if my baby's dead or not, my life should be looking pretty hopeful. And I feel sorry for anyone who died with this COVID thing. But I'm also a retired psychic that's thinking about going back and some being a paranormal investigator. So that's the reason why I'm being contacted. I also went to Bombay Lodge. A ship in my vision too. Which is also good. And there was these demons in my cell that were talking to me, giving me these codes and I was wearing these clothes. They kept out of my closet for the one night we were voyage. And then they told me it was Armageddon on the voyage. And also there's some stuff in my house that's missing, including one of my hats. So if you're stealing my shit, I'm paying my rent. I would like my hat back, my right, uh, what is it called? My slipper of the galaxy, my black uh, clip-on bra that clips off in the front, uh, my second iPod, my found my pin player, that my ex-boyfriend stole that. But a few things, it's like, was pretty recent. That someone went into the house when I went to get the mail and turned my back on them and ran out. I really don't know. God will get you and burn you to hell. Oh, I saw it goes. Thank you for listening to me. Anyway.